Hi, in this video, we'll look at a few specially chosen fractions and we will try to write them as percents. Remember, a percent is simply a fraction with 100 in the denominator. More precisely, we said the definition of n percent is simply n over 100 where n is a whole number. So now let's look at the fraction we have. We have 1 over 2. In the denominator, we see that we have a 2. If we add a 100, then we would we have seen in another video how to quickly use the definition and rewrite it as a percent. But right now, we have 2 in the denominator. However, this is what we can do with uh, 1 over 2. Remembering FFEF, or fundamental fact about equivalent fractions, which we discussed in another video, we know that this fraction is unchanged if we multiply the numerator and denominator by some same non-zero whole number. So in this situation, we would like to have 100 in the denominator. So what might we multiply both numerator and denominator by so that in the denominator we have exactly 100? I think you will say it's 50. So here we have 50. So FFEF tells us 1 half equals 1 times 50 over 2 times 50. And now we write this as 50 over 100 because 2 times 50 is um, 100. And now we're in good shape. As the definition says, 50 over 100 can also be written using the percent symbol. It is simply 50 with this percent symbol written like this. So 50 over 100 is just 50%. We proceed similarly um, to rewrite 3 over 20 as a percent. We notice that in the denominator we have 20 and not 100. We also know that 20 times 5 is 100. So with that knowledge, and we use FFEF, and we say 3 over 20 is in fact the same as the fraction when the numerator and denominator are both multiplied by 5. We chose 5 so that in the denominator we can have a 100. And so what we have here is 15 over 100, which we can now write as 15%. So once again, to do these problems, we use the definition of uh, percent. We also used FFEF, or fundamental fact about equivalent fractions. Thank you.